straight, constantly publicly calling that into question is so obnoxious and toxic. I wasn't going to comment on this, but I have to because the human rights campaign just put out an emergency alert for the first time in its multi-decade history uh, declaring a emergency situation and saying that it is unsafe to be LGBT in the United States. And it is particularly unsafe in the state of Florida right now where this creator and her husband create a lot of content, if not live. I'm not sure, but they are Disney-focused content creators. And we also know that Disney is in a massive war with DeSantis over their support for the LGBT community. So if you haven't watched this video, this creator talks about how her husband is always getting called gay and that it's hurtful and that you shouldn't be doing that to a person who's straight. And she also says that she was raised in theater and that she loves the gays. Yes, the gays. So first of all, please stop saying the gays. We are not a monolith. We are not one group of people. We are the LGBT community. Your husband doesn't even need to just be gay. He could have been bi or pan or queer and still been attracted to you. So even these commenters are really just too focused on one idea of what the LGBT community looks like. Um, look, I get being told by strangers on the internet that your spouse doesn't actually love or have attraction to you sounds obnoxious. It sounds unpleasant. It sounds like something you could probably block through comment filters and actual individual blocks of people. But you know what's a lot more than unpleasant? What's dangerous? What's taking people's lives, taking their children away from them, putting them into foster care for no good reason, criminalizing using bathrooms, getting teachers possibly fired from their jobs just for showing the movie Strange World in their Florida classroom, homophobia, <laughs> yay. So this creator says she loves the gays, which again, we are not the gays, we are a whole group of LGBTQIA plus people. Yeah, we've got a lot of acronyms because there's a lot of identities represented in that. We are being attacked. We are being criminalized. We are being called pedophiles. And guess what? Just for posting content on the internet, I regularly get called a groomer. I don't even like children. I don't really want them near me. If I could avoid them at Disney, I sure would do that. Yet, I'm apparently a pedophile. Cool. But you're upset that your husband is being called gay. Now, I might be willing to accept if you were concerned for your husband's safety by being perceived as a gay man in the state of Florida right now, but that is not what you're upset about. So, I need... <laughs> All of the people who claim to be allies, especially who claim to be allies that like Disney, that live in the state of Florida, to step it the F up. Because we are very seriously in a state of emergency. Literally, the human rights campaign, they declared that today. You can Google it, okay? We are in a very unsafe terrifying situation. Target is getting bomb threats just for putting some rainbow clothes on the rack. If you, not just you, but anybody out there who lives in the state of Florida or who likes Disney or honestly just lives anywhere in the U.S. at this point wants to be an ally, you need to be a full-throated standing up for our rights saying that it is not wrong, not offensive, it is normal, it is amazing, it is wonderful. You absolutely support wholeheartedly LGBT plus rights across the board, no matter what, period. End of story. Because you know what? Even videos like this that seem pretty innocent and seem focused on something else 
feed into the idea that it is wrong to be gay, that there is something to be upset about for being perceived as gay. And the real problem here is this binary idea of what gender and sexuality look like in the first place that's causing these people to say, oh, dancing is feminine and feminine men are gay and that there's nothing in between on gender or sexuality. I had to pause it and come back because honestly, this is getting too upset to talk about because we can't have people claiming to be our allies out here posting that it's upsetting to be called gay because my friends, myself, my entire community are literally being violently attacked, threatened, sent to prison, being called pedophiles. There were two women in Texas who were sent to jail because they kissed in front of a child when they were on a date together. And not even like made out sexy kissing like I see a lot of straight people do in Disney World and Disneyland all the time, but just like very simple, okay? We need y'all to step it up, okay? Things are terrifying. And if you're not going to be on our team right now, when will you be?